One Hour Smart Home here, and today we're gonna to show you how to install a 3 8 compression fitting. So what we've got going on here is we have a new faucet that we are installing, and the line, the new supply line, is 3 8 but the existing line, or the existing shutoff valve, is half an inch. So these will not fit together without a compression fitting. So that is what we've got here. This is a half inch outside diameter, which is uh, this side here, and then three eighths outside diameter on this side. So to install this, we'll show you what we're putting it on. Uh, you've got this new sink that we installed here, and or this new faucet. And to install this, what you're gonna do is you're just gonna put uh, Teflon tape on the threads here, you would put Teflon tape on these threads here as well. We'll include a link to Teflon tape, but you can pick it up at the box stores. Um, and we'll include a link to this adapter. You can also pick this up at box stores as well. However, you wanna make sure that you get something exactly like this, and that's what we've included in our link. Half inch female OD to three eighths inch OD. And the reason is, and it needs to be compression, the reason is is that the terminology for diameters in threading is different depending on what you are installing. There are flared, there are uh, metallic pipe uh, adapters, and there are different thread cuts. So you wanna make sure that you get half inch female OD by 3 8 inch OD for this brass compression fitting or this 3 8 inch compression compression fitting. And all you have to do then is uh, go ahead and screw this right on to the shutoff valve, like so. And then you can screw this on to the fitting. And now you will have your supply line to your new faucet connected. And you are all set to go for installing the 3 8 compression fitting, half inch to 3 8 so that your new faucet will work with your existing shutoff valves. So thank you for watching. Please like, please subscribe. Thank you.